Hey friends, just a quick five minute video to show you how Goat Quote works. I'm going to repurpose a book called The Science of Getting Rich by Wallace Wattles. Goat Quote is a software that we built um, to go through your book or PDF written content, whatever you've got, and it will pull out the best quotes so that you can use them on social media. I think of it like when you write a book you or make a podcast episode or whatever, the information is really great. There's a lot of good messages in there, but they're trapped and someone has to listen to the whole thing or read the whole book, etc., to get all those messages. But what we're going to do is go through, pull out all the great greatest quotes and set them free on the internet. So that's what Goat Quote does. We were spending upwards of 10, 12, 15, sometimes 15 hours to go through someone's whole book pull out hundreds of really great quotes, write captions and posts and things like that for them. Um, and goat quote is cool because you don't have to do any of that. You just have to click a button that um, does it for you. So we obviously goat quote uses AI. AI is not perfect. It's not the year 3000. It's only 2023. So we got to go through and kind of tweak the AI, that's fine. So that's, you know, that might take an hour or two, but it's way better than 15 hours. So when you log into Goat Quote, you can see here, we've got um, a little video, we've got some instructions to read, and uh, we're going to turn this book into quotes. We've got other things as well, posts and video scripts, but today we're just going to talk about quotes. Um, I'm going to go through and write some keywords here. Uh, the Science of Getting Rich by Wallace Waddles is a really great book. I've read it a bunch of times. Um, I'm just going to come up with these off the top of my head, but if it's your book, uh, that you're doing this for, you'll know the keywords and, um, themes of the book way better than I do. So, um, I'm going to write the word rich. We're going to use money. We are going to use desire, success, fear, faith, um, uh, mm -hmm. Fear, faith, action, opportunity, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That seems okay. There might be one more. And um, just so you know, the AI will not necessarily use exactly these words. It helps it find themes of variations of these words as well. Um, and... Ah, screw it. That's good. So let's go through and I know that the book starts on page nine. Sometimes you might have a foreword or things like that that's written by someone else. You might not want uh, it to go through or table of contents or stuff like that. So I just start on this page. We're going to leave the end page blank, um, which means repurpose right up until the end of the book. We're going to grab the file, which is here, and we're going to submit it. Um, now, on the next page, it's going to have a loading screen, and I am going to uh, pause this video because it takes, you know, 10 minutes to half an hour to repurpose a book, and then I'll just show you the quotes page on the next page. So see you in a minute. All right, this is um, the loading page. Like I said, it will take... 10 minutes, uh, sometimes to half an hour, depending on how busy the server is, depending on how long the book is, etc. cetera. Um, so you can refresh this page. Um, if it's taking a while, just refresh it and have a look. Uh, otherwise, it will just pop up when it's ready with uh, all your quotes. So I'm going to let that happen, and I'll see you in a minute. All right, so here is the content. Um, this took about 15 or 20 minutes to do. We've got 253 results. It's not a super long book, so this is pretty good. Um, let's take a look. So on this screen, we have all the quotes. We have them all here. There's a couple of options for you. There's a couple of options for you. Firstly, um, you can download all of them here. Download all, boom. Then when you download all of them, um, it will put them into a like table, like a sheet on whatever 
platform you use, I guess, uh, numbers is probably it because it puts them into a, um, a sheet. Um, and you can edit them there, but you can also edit them in here. Hello. Like that. You just need to do that. And then you can download all if you wanted, once you were done. So you can easily edit things in here. Um, and you can remove them as well. If you're like, nope, this one sucks. Let's remove it. That's it. Now, some of these, like I said, some of these are going to be really good. I suspect there's about 100 really good ones in here. Um, and 50 okay ones, and then the rest are crap. So what we want to do is take some time. This is where I said earlier that you do need to check these and go through them. Um, but it's way, you know, you could, this might take you an hour, but it's way better than spending 15 hours going through and like writing stuff, like pulling all the quotes out of your book, writing captions. Um, we didn't do posts or video scripts this time, but, uh, that's a really fast way to get different content out of your book as well. So I'm going to go through a few of these right now because it's a great book and I feel like um, we'll be able to, we'll be able to see what's a good quote and what's not. So no man can rise to his greatest possible height in talent or soul development, unless he has plenty of money for to unfold the soul and to develop talent. He must have many things to use and he cannot have these things unless he has money to buy them with. It's a good quote. It's a good quote. It's a great book. Um, I think that the quotes are set to have like between usually five and I want to say like 40 words. So all of these are a little bit longer than usual because quite often they're like one line. But I think the sentences in the book are a bit longer and so it will work with the sentences in the book. Um, so that's a good one. Let's leave it. Man's right to life means his right to have the free and unrestricted use of all the things which may be necessary to his fullest mental, spiritual, and physical unfoldment, or in other words, his right to be rich. Decent. The purpose of nature is the advancement and unfoldment of life, and every man should have all that can contribute to the power, elegance, beauty, and richness of life. To be less, to be content with less is sinful. Um, some people might disagree with that. Could be you know, but hey, this is the book. This is a quote from a book. And also we want to be a little bit controversial sometimes. Um, every person naturally wants to become all that he's capable of becoming. This desire to realize innate possibilities is inherent in human nature. We cannot help wanting to be all that we can be. Great. There's nothing wrong in wanting to get rich. Could be a good quote on its own. The desire for riches is really the desire for a richer, fuller, and more abundant life. And that desire is praiseworthy. Great. So there's a lot of good quotes here. You can see that I'm going to find a bad one. This is a good, this is a bad one. This is a good, bad one. The reader who would dig to the philosophical foundations is advised to read Hegel and Emerson. Like fine, but it's not super. If I, if this was my book, I wouldn't put that quote out because it's like, people are like, I don't know who those are. I don't know what you're talking about. It doesn't make sense out of context. When we're looking for quotes, we want them to do two things. Um, we want them, well, three things. One of them is the length. We want it to be the right length, but I already did that for you when I was putting goat quote. Then we want it to make sense out of context. That's the number one most important thing, really. And then the number two thing is uh, we want it to have a point. Does it teach something? Is it helpful? Is it worth saying? So... Those are the two things. We're going to remove this one. Boom. Okay, this is another good, bad one. If you wish to reap the fruits of their philosophies in actual practice, read this book and do exactly as it tells you to do. Whose philosophies? We don't know. Doesn't make sense. It's not, doesn't make sense out of context. Now, if I knew what it was and I thought this quote was really good, I might come in here and say, whatever the context is, and I might put it in these. Whatever the name of the person is, maybe I thought that would be a good quote, then whatever it is, but it's not a very good quote, so I'm just going to remove it. We've got a lot of quotes. To live fully in soul, man must have love, and love is denied expression by poverty. Good quote. Well, I'm going to leave it. I didn't even read these ones up here, but 
it's fine. They're probably fine. It is perfectly right that you should desire to be rich. If you're a normal man or woman, you cannot help doing so. And I would add non-binary person, but this is an old book. Great. Perfectly right that you should give your best attention to the science of getting rich, for it is the noblest and most necessary of all studies. I love how controversial it is. A lot of people would argue with this, but I love it. Um, getting rich is not a matter of environment, for if it were, all the people in certain neighborhoods would become wealthy. Zing. Not primarily a matter of environment. Cool. This is a good one. This is a good bad one. Getting rich is a result of doing things in a certain way. Now, a certain way in this book, if you haven't read this book, he talks about a certain way a lot and he explains what it means. But if you're just reading this on a quote card, you don't know what it means. You don't have the context. So we're going to get rid of it. And so also we've seen that it is not a matter of environment. At this point, if you just read this on a quote card, you would not know what this meant. So we're going to delete it. And I have told the AI in many different ways to make sure that the quote is in context. But as of right now, the AI hasn't figured out how to do that. So, you know, this is just uh, an iteration. Now, we've got a whole bunch of other things. I'm not going to go through every uh, every one because that would be insane. I went when I went down here before I saw a bunch of crap ones. So it almost feels like it was getting to the end and it was like, Ugh. This is a good one. The best thing you can do for the whole world is to make the most of yourself. Pretty good. Um, do every day what you can do be done that day. Taking care of things. Yep, good. Prizes are given for wealth and happiness in all departments of life. Don't know what that means. Send $1 for a year's subscription to the Nautilus. Old book. We don't know what this is. Read this book. No. Read How to Grow a Success by Elizabeth Town. That's a really weird quote from a book to promote itself or promote another book. So let's just get rid of it. Don't know what this means. Do you want more books on how to succeed? See, this is what I was saying. Remember at the I said at the end of the book, I'm just going to leave it blank so it can repurpose right up until the end. Sometimes at the end of books, there's a bunch of stuff. Uh, it might be uh, kind of like an epilogue type stuff. Uh, not an epilogue. What's the word I want? Just a bunch of other stuff and uh, usually promoting other things or whatever. And you may not want to repurpose that. And this is why. This isn't even a sentence. This is AI getting weird. Uh, again, the end book stuff, end of, end of book stuff. That doesn't make sense. Send 10 cents. No. Marital unrest, a new remedy. What is that? So I didn't go through all of these. There are going to be some crappy ones in the middle as well. I, there was some at the beginning, there's some at the end, and there's definitely going to be some in the middle. But we've still got 239 results as of right now, which is pretty cool. So I reckon, yeah, maybe there'll be a few uh, more than I thought, maybe 150 um, really great quotes out of this. And you can do posts and video scripts as well, like I said. Plus, coming soon, we've got graphics, which is going to take, you'll be able to download all of these and then upload them to Goat Graphics, which is coming soon. Um, I'm not going to actually build it in here just because it's quite a lot for the server to manage for this tool. Um, and it will, with one click, take all of these quotes that you've got that you're happy with and it will, uh, you upload your branding, your like colors, logo, anything else, some background images. And then it will create uh, almost by kind of randomizing, but based on some different variables, it will create hundreds of variations of quote cards from these quotes. So, and they'll all be branded, they'll have images, they'll have different shapes as well, you know, vertical, wide, um, Pinterest pins, stuff like that. And so you'll be able to download all of those with one click as well, which is super duper cool. So I'm all about these quotes. Um, if you think that this tool is great, I certainly do, and uh, you want to give it a go with your book or your content, check out the link underneath of this video uh, because there's a bunch of other tools that I have as well for people who write books, who have content, who have written content especially. Um, but take a look. Go take a look uh, at Goat Quote. Grab yourself a membership. Um, it is on a lifetime deal right now, so it's not a subscription. It's a lifetime deal, so check it out. 
If you've got questions, hit me up in the comments below this video. And um, yeah, I'll see you in the next one.